the vacuum pen tablet is already connected and the requested drivers are already installed let us check once in device manager okay so it should be located under human interface devices vacuum tablet is listed here so the drivers are already installed so it should be able to work now see always keep in mind that uh, this vacuum tablet can work even without uh, without the drivers being installed but only if the drivers are installed you'll be able to use the stylus or else uh, you'll be able to use this uh, uh, pen tablet just like a mouse okay so if you want to use this uh, pen tablet then you'll have to install the drivers from the vacuum website and there is only one version of um, uh, software that is a driver software that is available in vacuum website so irrespective of the type of the model which you have purchased all the devices will be sharing the same drivers right so once the driver is installed you will be able to see this uh, windows ink workspace icon here the one with the stylus so when you click on that it will show you the sketch pad okay so this is where we are uh, actually going to right so this is a sketchpad so this, this shows something which i have already written earlier okay so here uh, at the top if you see at the top uh, this one is the pen ballpoint pen if you click on this you'll be able to see the various colors and uh, you'll be also able to adjust the thickness of the uh, pen so this being the maximum thickness the minimum thickness can be again go like this so this is the minimum thickness so depending upon the recommends you can go with either minimum or maximum or whatever maybe the level and this one is the pencil so again for pencil also we have various colors so let me select the bigger size right see it is not visible much so this is how pencil works and next we have the highlighter which can highlight and we have only very few colors listed here again uh, for highlighters also we have this size which can be varied so when the highlighter is used whatever we have written on the background that will not get erased that will not be overwritten next we have the eraser So all you have to do is, you know, it can the eraser can erase whatever that is written in a single stroke. Next we have protractor as well as ruler. So this is not required. So this is for touch writing, and this is for undo, and this one is for redo. This one is for a uh, cropping. What we have uh, written, and uh, next we have this clear all option. So if some suppose if you have written, you have utilized the complete page, and if you want to clear everything in a stretch, rather than going and deleting, uh, erasing each and every uh, uh, thing, what you can do is you can simply click on clear all. This will clear the workspace. So that is clear all. Then we have this save us. When you click on save, it will save the file as a a png file and again this is for copying and this is for sharing so this windows ink workspace uh, will work uh, you know will get installed when you install the vacuum driver so for downloading the vacuum drivers we have you will have to go to a vacuum website or you can use a simple google search for downloading the vacuum drivers you have just give the keyword as vacuum pen tablet drivers download you will find a authentic link now let us see what can be done in this sketchpad right suppose if you are if you are a max teacher and if you want to write a lot of equations right so in such cases this one will be really handy so adjust the thickness whatever uh, you are willing to have and choose the color so i'm going to choose uh, red here 
okay suppose if i'm going to write uh, a very simple formula so this can write really fast so just like writing on a piece of paper so this is, uh, it can capture your handwriting as such so that is the excellent feature of this tablet and you can also you know you can write anything you can you can put uh, square roots and you can put brackets inside and you can write an equation inside without worrying about the formatting right nothing stops there is no uh, boundaries for route for writing here so it is like a, a plain paper where you are going to write something right so and uh, the one more feature of this pen tablet is you will have a workspace so, you know uh, the complete workspace is shown in a dotted format in the actual pen tablet i'm talking so the pen tablet will have four corners so the four corners right the four, the four corners will be exactly mapped on four corners so which means whenever you are going to write on the corner on the left corner left bottom left corner of your tab the same thing is going to be replicated on the bottom left uh, on your screen so wherever you write it is it is no it is completely uh, mapped it is completely mapped with your screen so if you want to you know uh, move the mouse pointer to a top uh, right if, if you want to move the mouse pointer to the right hand side you simply go to the right hand side that's it you need not drag the mouse pointer there it is not like a regular mouse the stylus when you hover around the tab uh, it will it will work like a cursor right and the buttons that is present on the uh, stylus the, you will find two buttons those buttons are also customizable in my case i have customized them for erasing purpose which means when i when i uh, use that I, I mean when i when i press those buttons that will erase whatever i have written right see so i am actually pressing the button and i'm moving the stylus so that is going to erase so instead of rather than going here and selecting the erase button again and again suppose if i want to erase something like a or this one i can use i can press simply press the button and i can also use it so for customizing the uh, uh, stylus you will have to go to you have to search for vacuum you will find this vacuum tablet pro properties this is an application that is installed so here you will have this pen option so here uh, you can you can you know you can modify the options i have chosen as an erase so in fact it this comes with two oh, buttons you can have two different uh, options configured but i don't use it much i use it only for writing so for online classes so I I feel erase button is pretty much required for my case, right? So and uh, mapping again. Uh, so in my case, I have mapped the entire uh, pen tablet to the uh, computer monitor. So so if 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 I write in the bottom left corner, the same thing will be reflected on the computer's bottom left corner. Again, this can be con. This is a configurable uh, parameter. So if you have, if you change this uh, screen area to portion, and if you, you know, adjust the portion, then only that particular area will be uh, uh, covered while writing. So that is one advantage. And again, this the same thing can be also done uh, on the tablet side. So like just like in the screen side. So this is for tablet. So if I reduce the size, only that particular area from the tablet will be used. The other area will be undefined, will be unused. Okay, so that is all about uh, the working of pen tablet. So this mo this one is the Wacom pen tablet. Uh, the model is CTL four seven two, which is a very basic model, the entry price model. In fact, uh, in Amazon, this particular model is sold for rupees three thousand seven hundred, and I bought it from a local store for rupees four thousand two hundred and um, that's it so uh, i think if you are going to take online classes and uh, if you're going to write a lot then i think this particular tab will be 
pretty much enough suppose if you want more a bigger uh, slate then you can go for ctl672 the next model which is available for some 7000 rupees the only difference between ctl472 and ctl672 is the uh, size only the size varies so this is a smaller model which is sufficient for me because i i have some space constraints on my work table so if you don't have such constraints you can go for the medium one similarly if you are going to work on uh, softwares like photoshop or if you are going to do uh, some editing works in photos and if you require uh, such applications to be uh, there on your system then uh, i don't think this one will be sufficient because as because this this tablet is meant is used is going to be used only for uh, education purpose for uh, writing something on a whiteboard uh, the pressure levels are not that much here in this case so if you want to have such precise pressure levels uh, in which has a lot of which has a wide range of pressure levels then you should go for uh, tablets like intuos uh, wacom intuos pro or something from the higher end so that's it if you like this video uh, please click on like button and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this and thank you for watching